Senator Abiru told his colleagues that the nominees are not only experienced in their respective fields of endeavor, but also possess the requisite qualifications to excel in the MPC. The membership includes four deputy governors, Mohamed Abdullahi, Bala Bello, M.M. Usoro, and Philip Ikazo. Speaking immediately after the confirmation of Cardoso as chairman of the MPC and 11 other members, President of the Senate, Gosul Akbabio, hailed President Bola Tinubu for selecting men and women of great expertise that will help the country with policies that would help turn around the CBN and redirect the monetary policies of the Federation for the good of all Nigerians. The Senate in the Committee of the Whole considered the report of the Committee on Banking insurance and other financial institutions on the screening of Mr. President's nominees for appointment as members of the Monetary Policy Committee of the Central Bank of Nigeria and approved the nominations of Olayemi Kadusu as chairman, Mohamed Sani Abdullahi as member, Bala Bello as member, M.M. Usoro as member, Philip Ikazo as member, Javier Lydia Shehu as member, Lamido Yuguda as member, Moritala Sabo Sagagi as member, Aloysius Uche Odu as member, Agu Pauline Odinkemelu as member, Mustafa Akiyomi as member, and Bandele Eji Amor as member. So this approval by the Senate is for the chairman and members of the Monetary Policy Committee of the Central Bank of Nigeria. Is this a true reflection of what transpired in the Committee of the Whole? Yes. The confirmation of the new MPC members comes days to the first policy meeting of the Apex Bank under the new CBN governor, which has been slated for February 26 and 27, 2024. Uyi Agbomofwegwe reporting for Global Television News.